Emma. Hi, Trini. Who's, who's in the house? Hi, Susanna. Oh, what underwear is in the house? <laughs> when I wear this, you need to know now, this is Alterations with a Susanna Closet <laughs> Confessions. So, darling, we're starting with part two. We are concerned, as Susanna, with the idea of fast fashion and just having more responsibility around how we wear our clothes. Do you remember the really expensive Christian Dior thing I bought, which I haven't worn because the length is too long, and I have no idea what S. Susanna can do with it. Okay. Um, we've got an old leopard thing, which I love. We've got one of my favorite dresses from GMB Savali from H&M, but it's like I've gone to the kind of debutante tea party and it wears me. So lots okay. of things. A very Sweet. mad caftan, you know, which wears oh. me as well. So, so much to go through. And you are gonna have things like this in your wardrobe that you're not getting rid of, but you don't wear. So let's make them wearable again. Let's give them a new lease of life, all right? So we're gonna start, darling, with, this is all about making the waist fit your waist on a dress, all right? So for me, this was a very high-waisted dress, and it just felt that way. We didn't yeah. see this last but time. It was really nice. This is a sneaky one I did later, but I got this from Zimmerman, and Zimmerman is one of my favorite designers, but they're always high the waist, so yes. you put the loops yeah. lower, yeah. which are now on my waist yeah, yeah. and then I've got to look for a belt for it so should we start it yes. up now yes. so as Susanna why do you add the belt loops back instead of just cutting them off completely because I think on, on that dress uh, I think the belt it looks better more, more chic more. oh more like chic better. yeah I'm just going to look at a few things like that what do we think of that it's very strong it's dominating I don't know if the gold is a lot yes maybe a, a thinner one Tini. this idea could be a very th it's a thin yeah it might not even need the belt loops yeah it does this belt loop but just gives it something. You're right. Nice. Okay, the yeah. other thing, you know what I'm going to say to you? You know what she doesn't do to her dresses? Walkers. Walkers. I'm, I'm yes. so missing I think we got, we putting my hand in the pocket. I think it's nice if we could put you know, some it, Yeah. It that changes nice. the dress. It changed completely. How many dresses have we put pockets in? Oh my God. So like a hundred. A hundred. A hundred. At least a hundred. <laughs> okay, so I think it's now going to go back to Essie Valley. This is always the right time. I think I've got it. Okay. The sun is out. I'm going to wear it. No. It's got to go back there. So these ones, darling, we want to make them less like pyjamas. So I've tucked it in. You've done the waistband beautifully. Yes, flat. Um, there. So it's flat now, yes. so it doesn't feel so pyjamary, but I can wear it as pyjamas. It's got pockets. I've taken, you've taken you, yes, I, sure. you, a <laughs> little bit that ankle. Yes. I yes. think the cut here, I'm still thinking we might want to tweak that. Yes, Trin. Yeah, we you need know. at least yeah. two centimeter, three centimeter higher. Because yeah. I'll tell you what I, I do feel is you can always afford to go higher than the waistband. And the reason is when you tuck something in, so if this was here, just to give you an idea of that, and that's higher than the waistband, by the time I tuck it in, and push it back that will fall over yes and it will be all right if you're going to make the effort to change it of course you've got to get it right so you're going to wear it yeah, that's yeah, that's yeah. the kind of yeah, no, the moral not. tale in this story yes. this is all going to be about the shoulder pad movement i believe and advocate strongly a fantastic undergarment shoulder pad thing and this is the best thing i ever bought from zara it was like 20 quid i mean it smells quite bad because i never want to give it up for washing and um so i thought <laughs> how can we make it again and i thought we could make one like this exactly, which you're going to show me today, and then one that we can wear as an undergarment, which maybe we can all benefit from when we've got it sorted out and the pattern sorted out. So we're yeah. working on the pattern on this. So I'm just going to do the white one first. So this is a copy in silk, because the other is in a satin, which yeah. is not breathable, and this is a breathable silk, yeah? yeah it's a silk, yeah. Okay. Okay. So does this feel, I don't feel this feels as shoulder paddy as this, even feeling it. What's putting me off is the white here that I can see. The, the lining? Yeah, that, that's putting me off. So maybe we can uh, do so like let's a, think about that. Like a, uh, again, the skin tone. Thing. We if could I, do skin tone. Yeah, yeah. But what's really clever about what you've done, uh, Susanna, is I feel it's a piece of an arm. It's not a shoulder pad mm -hmm. underneath the top. Mm -hmm. And I yeah. think the pleating does that. Yeah, 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 yeah. And so that's, but when I look at this, I mean, the proof is in the pudding. If I wore this under something, let's see what it looked like. This is And Other Stories, pajama cohort. Oh, wow. Um, I haven't seen, seen this. Either, have you? No. We did this all off camera when you weren't there. 
Or did Sneaky. Molly do it? Nice no, you two nice had a little time. meeting yeah. before, I think. Really nice it's good, isn't it? Yeah. Doesn't it? Yeah. Lovely. You see, it's much better than just a shoulder pad. Exactly. You see what I mean? No, of course. It, it is layering, but if I just if we just put shoulder pads under here, it, won't even it look would nice. not be the same. No, no. It, it, it really know? looks very natural. It does, doesn't it? Really nice. Yeah. Yeah. yeah you never see a yeah. break. Yes. Yeah. You yeah. don't see a break, and that's yeah. the, the art here. And then I like that. That's exactly the right good. level. Yes. So see the gold on the other ones. Lovely. The perfect half tuck. Loving this. Yeah. This is a slightly washy outy salmon, mm. and I need depth to my lip. Do you see? Yeah. Just to bring my face back into focus. So much better. Yeah, it is so much better because oh, yes. it doesn't wash me out. Beautiful. Yeah. I love. I'm gonna like wear this now. This is just oh, brilliant, as is on And it was such a small tweak. Yes. And it's yes. made me fall in love again. So good. And it's a proper outfit. And it was just hanging in my covered unloved and unworn and now it's going to be loved and worn <laughs> so we're now going on to dresses that i have never worn and i bought this is the first one i'm gonna look in the mirror and let's look at it and let's think so see it now all right this is from gmb stavali for h m but whenever i put it on i feel there are so many frills what do we think we can do with this dress or should i get rid of it i think there are so many frills yeah we can disappear one of these frills one of them yeah. Uh, yes, and then probably even just elastic on the sleeve. You see, because then you can do what what you usually do. Okay. This is the. Surely. I think it's a good. I feel like it would be nice to see it with sort of almost like a belt or something in the middle to of like the it. pink or yeah, something to break, to break up the pattern. I think we need to break it. Well, That's the first thing, and I would agree with that. That already does break it up a bit. Mm. Mm. Gives it um, some structure. Yeah. And it makes it edgy too. Yeah, it? yes. it's that with the leather, I think you just want to get away from mm. all of the ruffles. The problem with a sleeve this wise is it gives no emphasis to your body shape mm. because yeah. there's so no opportunity more. to see that. So it's a lot of work. And in all of this work, I'm so hot and sweaty, I'm going to get rid of it. No, I'm not keeping it. Little tweaks, says Susanna, which I noticed in these shirts. And I bought three of these shirts in the sale from Vampire's Wife, and they were 60 quid each. I saw Sue Ran Jones at the BAFTAs mm -hmm. wear one of them, and nice. a few other people wear them, and I thought, oh, yeah. She loves a Vampire's oh. Wife, doesn't she? she? Loves it, doesn't <laughs> this is too open, mm -hmm. okay? It's just, it doesn't fit my um, neck. So okay. all we need to do yes, is we make... want it to fit my neck. Yes. And do you see, once it fits my neck, the collar hangs so much better. Yeah. Yes. Uh, yeah. The, yeah. We have to reduce the under collar. So, so would you do that to all of your vampire's wife shirts? Yeah. I, I yeah. Got, I got so I need to do this, and then you can feel the, uh, that this is right. Yeah. Okay. All right. Like a permanent safety pin. But that makes such a difference. And yes. every time I put these on, I haven't worn them, and it took me about three times of putting them on to realise it was because the collar felt too big. Mm. So. That now oh, much feels better, so sleep. much better. Yes. Yeah. And I'll wear it. I mean, it's the most beautiful yes. thing, just literally with this, which is that real 70s vibe. I mean, black and navy, by the way, I do love. Somebody asked me the other day. And it depends on the navy. And this is what I call an indigo navy. And it looks great with black. It does. Yeah. Nice. Taking an old caftan and making it a piece of day wear. This is a very old Elizabeth Hurley Beach. Do you remember it? I think you've yes, played and, and taken this in yeah, and yes, taken yes. it out over the years. I, I mean, some things that you, I pick up as Susanna, you go, we've been there three times with this outfit. Because <laughs> you know, we do, they do have a long life and they do change shape over the years. And the more fabric they have, the more opportunity there is for them to change shape. I can't really fit it anymore um, how it is because it's just too tight. So what I thought was it would look really nice over leopard trousers, but this, needs to come up to here. Yes. So then yeah. it just flows. Yeah. 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 So we just answer. it's just that sort of slash and wear. <laughs> slash, and wear. slash and wear. But this can happen to so many dresses which you feel are too tight is a way to wear them as a sort of tunic dress over trousers. Yeah, layering piece. I mean, I'm so happy to have this back. That feeling when something is a little bit too tight and you feel there's that little baby that's three months <laughs> pregnant with Lila. <laughs> Do you oh, remember, I remember that the wonderful world in December? Do you remember yes. this? Okay, this yes. was weird little things that went like that. And yes. we sewed this up in the it middle here. In the middle. Yes. It was open in the middle and we sewed that up to make it a halter neck. I think it's lovely. I know, it's better like this. For, for my shape, <laughs> it's better like this, but it was a Diana Hoff and it, it kind of came like that. Yeah. Yes. And up. 
You didn't suit did yeah. you? By the way, you change. We you change it. And I think with a belt, it's great. It had a belt that was in its own fabric, which I've lost, so I'll do it with oh. gold belt. But I think I love the waist. I love the flop of the trouser. I love the fact that when you're in a hot country and you don't want to wear a dress, but you want to feel chilled, this is my go-to. Are you going to be able to find a fabric? Yes, do you I'm need sure. to take it with you to find yes, a fabric? Please, you do, you don't mind. <laughs> and then, uh, Susanna, yes, you've got to see if you still have the pattern. I do have the patterns. Do you? Do you have yes. all my patterns in oh, a little? I tell you, I have your patterns for years. Do Any, you? Anything you ask me, you is, still have is the pattern. there. For Hallelujah! I don't have to pay for a pattern! <laughs> <laughs> okay. These are great white trousers I used to wear with a high heel, but I no longer wear high, high heels, and I want to wear them as a long white trouser with my favorite trainer, which they go over. So we're just going to make them that length there, Susanna, that I've Yeah, yes. Yeah? Is that right. the right length? Perfect. I think it's a good, yeah. Thank you. My white trouser, I want to crop. And I don't wear these. The length is too long to wear them with shoes because I don't like that kind of length. So, darling, what I want to do is just make them so they're okay. like that for the summer. And having a high-waisted white trouser, which doesn't show everything through and doesn't, Shows the pockets a bit, but not much. Mm. Where are these from? Zara. And oh. They, they, they used to make the best yeah. white trousers. Is the top Zara as well? The top is utter Q, oh. which I heard is closing down. They have Do closed, yeah. They have closed. Yeah. Isn't that gutting? I know. Yeah, I think that's good. What a dress. Mm. This is a really interesting dress, and it's from a designer, Aphrodite Hera. It's really expensive. She sent it to me about three years ago, and I haven't worn it. So I've got to think, why am I not wearing it and what can I do to it, darling? So this is weird, mm -hmm. unless that's meant to be at the back now. This, and I think it's showing oh. the different ways you can wear it, or do you see what I mean? Because I think her things can yeah. be back to front. Yeah, they can. So is this that dress? Oh, this pops up under and it turns into like a cape. You might be right. Can you pop that open? Yes, I can. Hang on, if ever. Okay. Oh, and then that would be the back. But do we like it undone more than done up? Do the poppers pop round at the back as well? Like like that. Yeah. So if it was sort of like that. No, it I know, but imagine oh, if that's it did. So nice. Do that. Maybe we could do that, yeah. we could do that okay, because that's even. fab. Actually. That's a brilliant like pattern that. on you. Well, that's cool. I mean, that's changed the dress, hasn't it? And the back looks great. Yeah. Yeah. So right. you'd, you'd put the popper there. Yeah, Jenny. Yeah. And then I'll just wear it like that. Mm. And then I got so my cool. figure really because nice. it was the overwhelmingness of the fabric. Yeah. It's a whole yes. Gosh, I'm glad we found really? that popper. <laughs> That's so exciting. And then you have this unexpectedness coming yeah, out. Yeah, very nice. Which is kind of fab. So a popper change to change the dress. <laughs> Love that. Wow. This is the kind of amazing jacket, which I got as a real impulse. So I kind of feel I wish I hadn't bought it because it was very expensive. This is the issue, all right, is that it's this length for me isn't great, all right? Mm. It's just too long. So Listen. do we ruin it no. if we do this? Do we ruin no, no, the do pockets? You? Well, this length is better than the longer length because it doesn't make my legs look as short. That length, yeah. I feel yeah, just a bit cuts me. So the I pocket would just be at the very edge, edge wouldn't I it? Know. No, the pocket, they need to be just higher, Trini, a little bit higher. Could you do that? Yes. Yeah, because we're going to have the hem here anyway, and a new hem. So just moving the pockets a little bit, and then shorten. But do we think that is the right length? What do you know. think is? If it was that length, is that a yeah. better length? I think that's better. Much better, Trini, yes. Because we need the hem again, the original hem, and then we just make oh, the pocket okay, a little bit okay. in proportion. Would you keep the black buttons? Yeah, I probably would. I think things like that, then you change it too much. Yeah. Right, okay, so okay. we move the pocket. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. It's a huge risk. I could just sell it, but I want to keep it, and I want to keep the essence of what it is, but just make it suit me. Yeah. What I have to say is, as Susanna and I are like in a marriage, because there's <laughs> bad phases and there's good phases. I can be a total... <laughs> she can she can not listen to me properly. I always put it that way. I couldn't do anything without you. I'd buy a Zara 19 pound trousers and I had to have it fitted perfectly. And lots of you who watch the alterations shows with Susanna will know that's how we like it. If we like clothes that really work well. And that's why you can take any clothes and it doesn't matter the price. 
if it fits you incredibly well, it looks so much better. Oh. What are we going to do next week, Jemima? I think we should do some more colour. Okay, we could think about some more colour. Um, I still want to do that idea of doing what's your style this summer? Yeah, I You know, like let's that. define our style. Yeah. Yeah? Let's think about that too, totally. but leave your um, comments below and have a lovely weekend. Thank you so much. Bye. Bye. Bye.